coming home, Dan? Actually, I've been meaning sort of about that. Some of the guys are not. It'd be nice to stay in for a second at all. Well, I hope you told them where to go. It's not something that you say no to, really. What? How can you do this to me? Sonny. What am I supposed to do now? <laughs> Jesus, Sonny. What's going on? Has something happened to Daniel? Talk to me, Sonny. It's been like this for hours. I don't know what's wrong with him. I took him to the doctors last week and they said it was just a cold. Dave, can you keep an eye on Toby for a bit? You tend to soothe him more than me these days. You're never around when she needs you, Daniel, you bloody fool. I heard he's an oil baron. He's made millions, apparently. I hope he's gorgeous, too. What's going on? George's cousin is in town. I heard he bought Dr. Stewart's old townhouse without even viewing it first. He's rolling in it. Blimey. He likes to make an entrance, doesn't he? <sighs> Hold your horses there, Linda. We don't know what the man's actually like. Oh, George. I'm sure if he's a relation of yours, he's lovely. <laughs> Come on, Sonny, pick up. Dave, everything okay with Toby? He's unsettled, yes. But look, Sonny, I saw the letter, and if you're going to see Harold... Just be careful. I know what he's like. Well, cheers for going through my stuff. Look, Dave, i got to sort this. Thanks for looking after Toby, yeah? Howdy, the name's Rex. <laughs> well, it's great to finally meet you. I'm long lost cousin George. <laughs> well, welcome to Jugans. Hey, George, we even look alike, don't we? <laughs> we all think. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm Linda. How about we get you a pint of our local brew, Rex? Yeah, that'd be nice, Linda. Thank you. Hi. <laughs> now, don't get me wrong. I'm glad that you're here, but. I have to say, it did come as some surprise. Yeah. Why now, Rex, after making a life for yourself somewhere else? Yeah, and it's great to finally be back home. It, it kind of feels right. I was just thinking about you. Harold, you know why I'm here. You can't expect me to cough up double rent just like that. I'm not made of money. I could lend you some money if you're a bit short. You know that. Harold, shh, I don't want you. Don't answer me now, have a think about it. We could set up a very simple transaction, you and I. I help you out of it, and you help me out of it. You just need to be friendly towards me, sunshine. Sonny! It's Toby, I think he's getting worse! Sonny!